last updated, the 19th of March 23 8 a.m. Robert Kraft was charged with solicitation of prostitution in late February. The attorney of New England Patriots owner Robert Kraft is fighting back against law enforcement officials in South Florida. William Burke, who represents Kraft, issued a statement to ESPN's Adam Schefter on Friday evening. Kraft is facing misdemeanor charges of soliciting prostitution at a massage parlor in Jupiter, Florida, but he has pleaded not guilty, there was no human trafficking and law enforcement knows it, Burke told Schefter, who posted the quote on his Twitter account. The video and the traffic stop were illegal and law enforcement just doesn't want to admit it, the state attorney needs to step up and do the right thing and investigate how the evidence in this case was obtained, Kraft and 24 other men accused in. The case were offered the opportunity to have their charges dropped if they performed 100 hours of community service, took a class on the dangers of prostitution, were tested for sexually transmitted diseases and paid a fine, according to the New York Times. Instead, Kraft is prepared to fight the charges. William Snyder, the sheriff of Martin County, Florida, said he expected surveillance video of Kraft's alleged illegal activities to be released before long, I do think ultimately they are probably going to get released, Snyder said during an interview with CNBC.